Hello, here we go again. <laughs> Back with a long awaited used Kardashian and Jenner clothing haul. And this time we're going to be using them to recreate the pictures that they actually took in these. But finding the rest of the outfit for much, much cheaper than they probably paid. All of these clothes are from the Kardashian closet website where you can buy the Kardashian and Jenner's actual used clothes. We've got Chris, Kim K, Kylie, Courtney, Kendall, and Chloe. And they have some wild stuff. Everything from literal underwear to ridiculous expensive couture items and really unique accessories. The last like year or two, I have personally really forgotten how to dress myself. But my question is, if I buy one of these items and then put together the exact same look that the Kardashians had, am I gonna feel more fabulous? Am I gonna feel more confident? Let's start with Miss Kendall. Oh, I'm so excited for these. Okay, disclaimer. There's about a 90% chance that this isn't going to fit. We're hoping that the fabric is stretchy. Oh, it's stretchy. Ah, it's all of my Lizzie McGuire movie dreams come true. Sax Pots is the brand. I'm assuming it's from the UK. It just sounds like it's from the UK, you know? <laughs> she wore these to uh, some sort of event. Brit Awards After Party. She actually had a matching top with the pants. I didn't see those in her closet but I lucked the heck out. I'm about to show you why. There I was, scouring the internet, because obviously this outfit just wouldn't be the same with any old top. So I stumbled upon this website called Selfridges, and guess what they had? And on clearance. That's right, the top, whoa. Really sorry, but if you remove me, you can't return me. You guys saw that, right? It removed itself. Time to find out if we can make these pants fit. Ah! <gasps> Guys! I got them on. <laughs> I'm obsessed and it's so comfy. So she has this cute little silver purse, very like 90s. So I did some digging on Poshmark and I found this one. It's not quite as shiny as hers, but it's definitely kind of the same look. I don't know what designer these shoes are that she's wearing, but apparently every like, cheap fashion marketplace collectively decided this is the shoe that we're gonna rip off this season because I didn't even have to look for these. I was typing in red high heels for a different outfit that I'm about to show you and these came up. Thank you, Amazon. Here they are. Wet kiss. I'm sure the ones that Kendall were wearing are not wet kiss, but. And then I think her hair is up in just like a little half up thing. There it is. Dang, I'm impressed with how this one turned out. <laughs> Yes, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, because at 950,000 subscribers, I'm giving away a $500 Apple gift card. And at 1 million, someone gets a Peloton and someone gets a $1,000 shopping spree. I think this might be the cheapest thing that I've ever gotten from Kim's closet. I feel like out of all the sisters, she definitely has the most expensive taste. <gasps> what is this? A prize for me? They shouldn't have. That was so nice. I'll be honest, I have not used a Kylie Jenner lipstick since like 2017. <laughs> the chokehold this stuff had on, oh, there's more. Oh, it's a whole kit. Okay, back to Kim's outfit. Whoa, it's little. What in the? Kim, what is this? <laughs> like, did North sew this? Cause it's the stitching, it's the straps. Um, from a distance, it looks fine. It's just up close. It caught me off guard a little bit. Okay, this is a pretty simple one, but we still have to accessorize. I found the perfect pair of heels on Poshmark. Yes, how great are these gonna be? I found both of these on Amazon. Oh no. Most definitely my least favorite of all the looks. This one. I believe, is actually two pieces of the outfit. There it is. <gasps> Tyler! Tyler, come here! You know how you always make fun of me for leaving pieces of tags on everything I own? Yeah. Well, look what Kylie Jenner did! Ooh. I don't know what that proves, but. <laughs> Are these shorts to go with it? A skirt. Oh, we Ooh. got we got some Kylie DNA. Ew. Why did you say it like that? Unless, do they have dogs? It looks pretty dog hair-esque. <laughs> Just like some Kylie Jenner's dogs, Bambi and Norman, and they literally don't have hair, so I don't know whose hair is on that skirt. This is so cute though, the black stitching. I'm excited. All right, so with this little set, Kylie's wearing like a, a cream colored tube top underneath, so I found this one at H&M for two bucks. I think it's gonna be perfect. A little sheer, but it'll be okay. Cute. 
god oh my gosh okay shoes so she's wearing these chunky sneakers with some ankle high socks so we've got filas which i'm pretty sure she's not wearing filas i'm sure she paid like 15 times the amount of money for whatever shoes she's wearing but oh my gosh <laughs> This is so perfect. Okay, the only thing that I don't have is a little like crossbody bag like she does that she's holding. I love how this outfit and this picture turned out, which is good because we really needed a win after that last dress. And now for the most expensive thing in the whole haul, of course it's from Kim's closet. I'm really excited about this outfit though. It is from Annie's Ibiza X Silo Papit. I've never heard of any of that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sounds fancy though. <gasps> it's beautiful. It looks a little tiny, so we'll see how that goes, but wow. The detail. Oh my gosh. I didn't even realize it was a dragon. That's so cool. And I love how she put it together as an outfit. Although I have to laugh at these pictures <laughs> because you know for a fact these weren't like cut off guard pics like they definitely hired a photographer to take these to make them look like they just weren't paying attention but there's so many of them who was it there was someone on tiktok i think it was tana and it's just it's so awkward i want to do one one day <laughs> like nobody walks like that unless you're trying to get the shot what am i talking about i'm about to go do that exact thing but it's just gonna be tyler taking them instead of a photographer so so with this skirt she's wearing a cute little five button cardigan top i got two of just in case one of them doesn't work out they're both like 10 bucks this one's h m this one's from a place called urban revideo okay so here's option one okay and then option two oh yeah this is the one much more fitted and then she's wearing these like red slide on heels so i found these ones on amazon they're dnky moment of truth well she's tight but i think we can make her work for a picture <laughs> one more thing i wanted to go all out for this one this is probably a terrible idea i feel like her long hair was such a statement in this look so <laughs> <laughs> if this works, it's gonna look good. I don't even know how to do this. Cute. Oh, it's like a lace front. I think my head's too big. I look more Halloween witch than I do Kim Kardashian, but I think we can make it work. Oh, we've got the length, that's for sure. Okay, maybe I don't hate it. What do I do with this though? Am I supposed to cut off the lace or leave it? <laughs> It's a look. This outfit was a neck breaker. Every person that walked or drove by. One lady told me that I looked beautiful though, so that was really sweet. I actually thought this outfit overall turned out pretty good. Pretty spot on, if I do say so myself. In conclusion, did I feel more fabulous? more confident a little like it was kind of nice to have a blueprint to put together outfits was it because it was owned by the kardashians or even because it was designer items though no in fact i liked some of my budget clothing pieces better than the designer ones <laughs> leo and i picked out some other videos that we thought you might like down below make sure to check out all of my other used kardashian clothing hauls if you haven't already and we will see you guys in the next one say bye youtube